you guys had cupcakes yesterday? Yeah, yum. I bet you they were delicious. That sounds really awesome. Hi everyone. It's Miss Heather and Joe. And Joe was just telling me that yesterday somebody in his class had a birthday, so they had cupcakes. Do you guys like cupcakes? What's your favorite thing to eat on your birthday? I like to eat cake. Do you guys like cake? Or do you prefer cupcakes? Yeah, it really doesn't matter what you eat as long as you celebrate. Well, actually, Joe's birthday just passed in December, and my birthday is actually tomorrow, February 7th. So all this talk about birthdays reminded me of a story. This story is called 10 Rules of the Birthday Wish. And it's about 10 rules to making and keeping a birthday wish. Do you guys make birthday wishes when you blow out your candles? Well, they do in this book and they'll give you 10 rules on how to do it correctly. 10 Rules of the Birthday Wish According to Beth Ferry and Tom Lichtenheld, read to you with permission from G.P. Putnam Sons, an imprint of Penguin Random House, LLC. There are, there most definitely are, 10 very specific, tried and true, and absolutely essential rules for the making of a birthday wish. In case any confusion about the number of rules, please place hands here. Rule number one, it must be your birthday or close to your birthday. Sometime in the last or next week, your age should have increased by one, unless you are a beetle, bug, or insect. If your life cycle is a month or a week or only a single day, please celebrate immediately ASAP. Flutter, flap, fly right on over to rule number two. Rule number two, you must have a party. A celebration, hoopla, or jamboree. There should be games and laughter and definitely hats. Hats immediately elevate the party mood. Food is also a good idea. See rule number three. As are streamers, confetti, and balloons. Unless you are a rhinoceros. Sorry. If you are a rhinoceros, a swordfish, sorry, a sea urchin, my bad, or pointy in any way, you may want to skip the balloons. Rule number three, you must have cake or cannoli or cream puffs or churros. Your dessert does not specifically have to start with the letter C, even if some of the best desserts do. The letter could be P or B or even I. Whatever letter your dessert starts with, it must be sturdy enough to accommodate rule number four. Rule number four, you must have a light or lights to blow out. Traditionally, this would be a candle, but it could also be a sparkler, unless you are a whale or a frog. If you are a whale, you may want to invite some fluorescent jellyfish to your party. If you are a frog, consider using fireflies as your candles and your dessert. Combining rules is completely acceptable. Either way, something lit must go dark. Rule number five, there must be singing. Traditionally, the happy birthday song. Sung happily and loudly and definitely off key. Unless your friends are feathered. If you're lucky enough to have friends who can warble, croon, or carry a tune, sit back and enjoy the show. Rule number six, you must close your eyes. Closing your eyes keeps your wish safe inside your head where it can grow from something ordinary into something extraordinary. Rule number seven, you must take a deep breath. This will ensure the success of rule number nine, unless you are a puffer fish. If you are a puffer fish, definitely do not take a big breath because then you will puff up and all your guests will be concerned. Everyone knows a puffed up puffer fish is not a happy puffer fish and happy is a big part of birthday. Rule number eight, this is the big one. 
You must make a wish. Just one wish. A single, wonderful, amazing wish. It can be a big wish or a little wish. It can be a now wish or a later wish. But it should definitely be a can't think of anything greater wish. Rule number nine. You must blow out the candles in one single breath. Unless you are a camel. If you are a camel, you will most likely spit on your cake as you are blowing out the candles. No one wants to eat a cake spritzed with camel spit, so please ask your friends to help. Combining breaths is completely acceptable. Rule number 10. Don't forget that wish ends in shh. So keep your wish quiet, silent, hush, hush. And when the fun is done and your friends have left and the moon is high in the sky, close your eyes and dream of your wish coming true. The end. When the moon is high in the sky, close your eyes and dream of your wish coming true. Aw, look at the little teddy bear. He's so cute. Hey everyone, did you enjoy this story? I told you it was funny. Did you see that there's some things in this story that we usually do at birthday parties, but for the last year, we've kind of done things a little differently. They had some big parties and everybody blew up the candles on their cake. Well, in this time where we're trying to keep everybody safe, those might not be the best idea right now, but you can still celebrate your birthday and you can still have a birthday wish. Tell us in the comments below how you celebrate your birthday. Do you guys have a tradition? Is there something that you like to do every time it's your birthday? Let us know. Well, since it's my birthday tomorrow and it will be you guys' birthday someday, we're gonna sing the happy birthday song but we're gonna sing it to everybody so that you guys can play this on your birthday and we'll sing you happy birthday, me and Jill. Are you ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear friends. Happy birthday to you. Good job, everyone. Do you guys wanna sing it with me? You can sing happy birthday to somebody in your family or just sing happy birthday because it's a fun song. You ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear friend. Happy birthday to you. Good job, everyone. Well, I have a big day tomorrow since it's my birthday, so I'm gonna go turn out the light so we can sing our story time rhyme. Be right back. Okay guys, let's sing our story time rhyme. Story time is done. Turn out the light. Grab your stuffy and hug it tight. Close your eyes and count those sheep. And soon you'll be fast asleep. Good job everyone. I hope you enjoyed story time today. Sweet dreams.